for me because I'm not good at this, but you know, I got a double driver, a CSM version 1.5. Okay, so I'm gonna open this and we're gonna have some fun. Right. I got a double driver in my boys, boys and girls. Oh. So here's the box by itself. The box by itself. That looks pretty nice. And place that on the ground. Like this. And now the main event. Hopefully nothing falls out. Look at that. So nice. How nice it is. I'm gonna take everything out. Uh, I'm gonna go through all the sounds. I'm gonna go, to go through all that stuff. So, um, if you like what you see in here, hit that follow button for me. Ah, all right. I'm also going to move the keyboard and put this on my desk so I can take things out easily. Uh, let's start with the, so this is the one of the belt straps. I think it's the left one, left or right one. It's one of them, one of the sides, right? I'm getting the boring stuff out of the way because it's boring. It's not much I can say about it. Um, I will put it together and show what it looks like. Here's the other side of it. Nice. There's a little little back part. It's, it, this is like um, adjustable, so I can actually adjust it to my weight, my waist. Uh, and it's gonna be good. And then here, this is just the thing. This is the back. It looks nice to make it look cool on the back of it. I'm putting all that stuff together, and that's it. Oh, this. this is just a side thing. We'll go button. I don't know if you guys can see that, but it's a little button right there. You can go into what that does a bit. So I'm gonna put it somewhere separate. You can't see my desk. It's a good thing. You don't. Want uh, but it's nice. Trust me. Uh, let's do. The so this is in the. This is the main event right here. Oh, uh, it goes through. It goes like that. You put it on your waist. Can't see my waist sitting, but... Interesting. So, there's actually no on-off switch for this. That's because this thing does nothing. It's just a shell. Plastic shell. It looks like it does in the shell, which is awesome. But we're gonna need that for the next thing. So, we're gonna put my trash over there. Okay. So, next, we'll be doing the memory. Just one slid out, because I looked at it earlier. Hmm, look at that. Joker memory. Joker guy memory is the thing we're going to take out in a second. And they suggested in the... Okay. okay. I don't know if that does anything, but let's see if... Oh, it does! Awesome. Uh, let me do it again. Joker. All right, we're going to need that. What's this one? This one is Cyclone. It, the backs are all going to be the same as the back of this one, so I'm not going to show them anymore. But So now... Something I'm going to be doing. It's pretty interesting. Uh, I know. So now, because you guys can see it, I have to switch my hands around a bit. Okay. I have to see what I'm doing. It's hard to do. I'm not used to doing this like this. So we put these. I'm do it on time. So do this. And then. We did it. Oh, that's cool. I can't, I can't, I was looking at that, it was too bright, but it's cool there. Ugh. Let me try something. I, I just want to try something. Alright, um, we're not going to do any more transformations for the minute. We're just going to, uh, we're just, we're just going to, I'm going to take the memories out, and then we're going to put them in here, and that's it. That's what we're going to do, and that's what it's going to be for the next little bit. Uh, so I hope you guys are excited for that. Ah, all right. So while I'm doing this, I guess I can talk about the season itself. This is my the driver. This driver is from my favorite season of Kamen Rider, Kamen Rider Double. Uh, it is one of my favorite. Was that? Hold up. There's a there's a film thing. I don't seem like it. Okay, whatever. But now we got the heat memory. Remember, yeah, all the same. So I'm not going to do that anymore. Uh, I will go into each of what the memories are meant to do in a minute. But yeah, look at that heat memory. It's nice. This one's interesting as well. You guys can't see it. The metal memory, as you can tell. Oh, I will go into what each memory is supposed to do in the show as well this time, because it is a CSM. And these look really nice. Like, these look super nice. So this is the Luna memory. And the last one that we have for you today that we're... Talk, uh, before we talk about them each individually, and I put them in the belt, uh, and talk about a little bit, a little bit about the show as well, just because I like the show. It's my, it's like I said, my favorite Common Rider season. 
Okay. So, before I continue, I want to say that if you like what you see, let me know, and I'll do more of this stuff. But now we're going to be talking about... Okay, yeah, now we're going to be talking about the show a little bit that this is from. It forms a W. Clever. Uh, so this is from Common Rider Double. So it is one of my favorite, if not my favorite, uh, Common Rider season, as I've stated before in this video already. Amy, I know how to keep trying to thought. Uh, the show is really good. I will make, I, I'm going to be making a Toku Time video on it with my buddy Matt is involved. Um, but he needs to finish watching the show first. Uh, we're watching it together. We are got to the movie, I think, and then stopped. So I think we're on episode 15 or 16. Um, so we're about one-fourth of the way through already, which is nice. Uh, but the show is good. I'm not going to be talking about the story, the plot, the characters. Uh, just know that this is a really cool thing. And now we're going to be talking about the memories. Okay, the first memory we're going to be talking about is... The cyclone memory. So this memory embodies the memory of the winds of um, the town of where the story takes place. It embodies the memory of the wind. So it's a cyclone. And then we have Joker. Uh, as many of you probably don't think, this is um, not from Persona. Stop it. I did not mean to press you, but... Um, it's not from Persona 5, it is uh, the embodiment of the fighter, like, a, like think of a fighter class from D&D or whatever. This is the embodiment of that. It's nice. Um, yeah, I'm going to put them back in here when I'm done talking about them. Uh, the next one is, okay, the next one we're going to be talking about is Heat. Uh, heat, that is the flaming, it's like a passionate heart type deal, you know? Uh, it's nice. It's a nice passionate heart that just uh, flew, flews out of it. And, and what do you think when, when you go with heat? You go with metal! Because metal is um, what comes of the heat. They, 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 you, know, you need heat to make good metal. That, that's what this is. Uh, it embodies the memories of strong... Um, resolve to do things. Strong like metal is the analogy there. Luna. What's that? Uh, it's a Gaia memory. I will talk about it in a second. This is a Gaia memory. This is the Luna Gaia memory. It's a nice thing. It's very cool. I like it. Um, it's, a, it's a collectible toy from Kamen Rider. Uh, you may not enjoy it, but I certainly do. So, that's what's important to me. Uh, this is the lunar memory. This has the um, memories of, like, being able to, of the imagination, basically. Looking like USB stick type bomb. Uh, it's not a bomb. It's, it just makes noises. But um, it, is, it does look like a USB stick, which is pretty interesting, I think. I think it's pretty interesting. It's not a bomb, though. Pretty cool. But I do have one that's a gun. We'll get to this one in a minute, but... It, it, it's nice. Um, it is very nice. So this it is like let, letting your imagination run wild and doing basically whatever you want to do uh, with all that stuff. Anything that your imagine, imagination can do, lunar, the Luna trigger, is, the Luna memory is for you. How much do you have of them? I have one, two, three, four, five. I have six. This is the sixth one. Uh, I will pull them all out again in a second. Just be patient. I want to talk about this one first. This one is Trigger. It's a gun. What do you think? Uh, it's, it has the memories of holding a gun. It pairs with the Luna one. Uh, don't worry. It's, it's a gun. I'm going to get the toy. Bomb. Bro, throw away money. Bro, throw money, money like it's air. Uh, no, um, I saved up for this one. Trust me, I, it's not, this was not cheap. This was about $200 where I bought it from. Uh, I bought it from Bluefin Brands, which is nice. Uh, 
I will when I make the video I'll post uh, a link in the description and probably edit this part out but yeah so now we're gonna put it in this thing I'm gonna put them each in this thing again and listen to the sounds it makes and then I'll give my thoughts on the on the uh, collectible as a whole but first we have uh, my wife would kill me if I buy socks here my guy chilling with weird USB hey man I'm not married I got no I'm a single Pringle dude let's get this going with uh, uh, I have to take this. So, see the little um, silver part that means something so you got to put it in the silver part uh, right there so let's do this and then the gold part but you got to press it you got to press the button otherwise it's not going to work I like the lights. Lights are pretty cool. So yeah, that's that's one set of what we can do with these things. Uh, I don't know why I took Joker out. I was not meaning to do that, but uh, I did. So now we'll put it in the middle key, or the middle, or yeah, I said middle. Yeah. Cool. It's like a it's it's a little white. You can't see because it's bright on the camera. Why are you playing with children's toys? Uh, because well, this actually is a um not a children's toy. This is not just a children's toy. This is actually meant for adults, and I'm an adult, so it's fine. I, and besides, I like it. Sorry, I didn't need to be here. It's all right, dude. Hey, Herbman. How you doing, bud? Uh, um, there are ones that are meant for kids, and I do have some that are more kid focused. Uh, but I've modified them to make them more adult focused because I like collecting things and this is what I collect. I collect video games and the, these tech things. Like, I have... Toei doesn't like the West when it comes to Kamen Rider. Sometimes. They are getting better. I'll give them that. They are getting better. Uh, but... Sometimes they're just not. And sometimes they're just like, dude, make your own fun. So I am. We're going to do this one now. Uh, this one is the heat memory. It goes with the memory. Cool. And yes, I am a big nerd, so accept it. Love me, please. I, li I like being loved. I want to put Luna in next. This one's a gun. You don't need to know anything. It's just a trigger. You don't need to know anything else. Yeah, isn't that cool? Oh, it looks so cool. Alright. So, that's actually not the only thing you can do. So, you can take trigger one out and put metal in here. And do that. And you can mix and match between the sets that I have, which is what I'm going to be doing now. It looks a little bit. That looks, I really like the lights. The lights are really doing something there for me. Uh, and then. Pretty sick, I think. I think it's pretty sick. Okay, so now, actually, another thing you can do, another thing I have, rather, is this. This thing is uh, basically what you can do with the finishers in the show. So, like, say you, you put one in there, you press the button, it does the finisher. So, let's put the Joker one in there, because this is what they normally do. And then they slide it in. Press the button, and it does the attack. And each one does it. So I think if I do heat, does that do something? It does. And each one has their own little sound as well, which is interesting. 
Let's see what triggers this, because I don't know what triggers this. I was expecting more for trigger, but all right. Just a little clicking, and I was like, all right. Let's see what Luna's is. This. Pretty nice. Uh, maybe we did that one. What's this one? Let's do Psych one next. It's interesting. Uh, fun. It's a lot of fun. Uh, I like doing stuff like this. So, next, I just want to see. There we go. That's what it looks like when it's attached to the belt pieces. Um, let me see. So this is what it looks like all around. It's the back of it without the thing on it. I'll put the thing on in a second. Pretty interesting. Uh, and then we'll put this on there. And now with the back on there, it looks like it, uh, it looks like it's completed, which is nice. And then you can put this on there as well. Um, and then bam, like that. And you can adjust it on the thing. So I'm going to adjust it like that. And there we go. That's that. Pretty cool, isn't it? So with that, that's pretty much all I want to say about that because there's not really much else to do besides putting it on and I don't really want to do that right now because I have a game I want to play as well. Uh, so yeah. Uh, if you guys enjoyed this, let me know and I will see you in the next one.